Motherhood is a complete game changer. I'm running around with Ava all day long. I don't have time to sit and clean out the fridge. What is wrong with us? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> did you smell that? No. That's pepperoni. It turned white. <laughs> I just threw up in my mouth. <laughs> Was that good? Baby girl, I'm so sorry. Do we have any sanitizer or anything? It's in one of these boxes. We could just spray this thing down. Uh, cologne? You have your cologne? I'm gonna spray on the cologne. I will then. It's not gonna take care of the snow. Yes, it will. It does when you go to the bathroom. <laughs> That's true. We've been approached several times throughout the course of our relationship. You know, when we got engaged, when we got married, when I was pregnant. It just was never the right time. I mean, there's there's that reality TV curse that you always hear about. Um, and I have to think a lot of that is when you start your relationship on camera. And we get to see the engagement. We see the wedding. We see the day after the wedding. Well, of course, those are the ones that have ended because you haven't had that private time to get to know your relationship because what we we're doing is we're opening it up and now now people out there can watch they can scrutinize they can disagree with our relationship they can you know criticize and if you're not comfortable in that relationship if you're not a hundred percent solid that's what breaks it up and after being married for two and a half years CMT approached us, Seacrest approached us, and it was the perfect mix at the perfect time. And again, you know, I think we're confident enough in what we're doing that we're good. Anything else? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Boy, do you need a break? <laughs> Our casa. Our casa. <laughs> Look at it. This place is awesome. It's huge. Up against this wall is going to be my huge TV with my two little TVs. It seems like an you elegant place, doesn't it? You did a good job picking this place out. Oh. This is so cool. I mean, this is something that you only dream about growing up in Dallas. It looks exactly like what I imagined a California house to look like. Yeah, I think reality TV has become so much about shock value lately. And it's who has the bigger temper tantrum and who says the craziest thing. And it's entertaining to watch. Don't get me wrong. I mean, yeah. we, we watch all that stuff. It's just not relatable. It's a little over the top. It's a little too much in-your-face shock. And I feel like we have a pretty normal relationship. You know, I feel like normal couple, couples bicker. You know, you fight, you get along, you laugh, and at the end of the day, you kind of have to brush off everything. And, you know, we that was important to us is to keep the relatability. I think that Melissa and I disagree all the time. No, we don't. Exactly. But we do a good job of... I mean, neither of us are going anywhere. And so, uh, you know, it's like, okay, you're stuck with me, so just get used to it. <laughs> and, uh, and, and Way to keep the romance yeah, alive. Right, you know, 